you today you find me at this fantastic property at Bath Road in Pickwick in Corsham and this is a really lovely two bedroom end of terrace cottage now it's not your average little tiny cottage it's actually a little bit bigger than normal with a really good dining area off the kitchen and you've also got a slightly extended bit there with also a single garage and parking and this absolutely fabulous garden. Now what you can't see here because of the mature trees and shrubs at the back is this actually lovely view as well which you'll see a little bit more when I show you inside. So come with me, let's take you inside. So let's take you inside this really nice little cottage in really good condition and ready for somebody to move into and make it their home. Now, we have to open up with a kitchen breakfast room. Now you're gonna look at this shot and think, where's the breakfast table going, Jane? So I'm just gonna swing round, quick glimpse back at the garden and show you that the other end of the kitchen is a really decent sized space for a fairly decent sized dining table, easily for a table for four, possibly even an occasional table for six. Nice to have this separate area. You've got the lovely two windows overlooking towards the parking area, that gives you loads of light. And then again, you've got this big window and the door with glazed section overlooking your garden as well. So, a nicely fitted out kitchen. You've got space for the washing machine. Obviously, you could have a fridge freezer on the right hand side here just before the door or you could even have it in more of the breakfast area if you wish. So fairly recently refitted in good cleaning condition and ready to use. Then we've got the nice little quirkiness of the cottage that starts coming into play with the beams and the dark wood. We step down a couple of steps into the living room, little bolt hole cupboard there, just to show you that. And that's officially the front door, back to the bath road, but mostly you're gonna come in through parking your car and coming in through the back. So we've got a really nice sized living room space here, really, really generous, especially for a two bedroom house. This has got a really nice size about it. And I'm just stepping well back into a kind of lobby area before I take you upstairs. So there's options in here for sofa seating. You could have corner sofa if you wanted to you could have two sofas you could even have a small table in here as well if you wanted to and do it a different way maybe use your breakfast area as a bit of a study now let's take you upstairs uh, not too bad a set of stairs for a little cottage wind up just round to the left hand side and then we've got two bedrooms on this level one up a couple of steps on the right hand side here and one straight ahead take you straight on in through to the main bedroom, so the larger of the two bedrooms, a good size double, not bad at all. You've got plenty of space in here for a double bed. You'd probably put it onto that wall over on that side. And then you've also got a cupboard just on the right. Now it does have the hot tank in it for the water, which is recently, looks like a fairly modern lagging system in there. Now just to say with this property, you do get electric heating throughout, but you also do have really nicely quite looking like quite newly refitted windows as well. So double glazed windows to the front. So really nice size in here and plenty of room for your double bed. You've got loft access as well. And then if I'm just gonna come back through to the landing, turn left and take you into what would be bedroom two. Although you could use this as a master bedroom, it would be a little bit snug as a double. It is just about a double bedroom. You can comfortably get a double bed at that end. Um, facing back towards this direction and then you've also got if I just come back and around another cupboard just sitting under there and space for a recess for a chest of drawers alternatively again this makes a fabulous kind of put up bedroom for people that just occasional stays and a fabulous study because just look at that view and what a lovely way to spend your day if you're working from home now you can see the garden down below so i'm going to take you outside now and give you a little bit of a guided tour around there so coming out through the kitchen door and out onto your garden space you've got a little pathway across 
and then it opens up into this really lovely garden now obviously it does need a little bit of love in places but you've got a really nice section here underneath this mature tree where you can have nice seating area you've got an area which could be a vegetable plot and then it opens up into lawn and more green space and again more mature trees and shrubs at the back even with a lovely what well, looks like a fruit tree there and also a lovely big buddleia bush for the butterflies now what's important with this is that you do have apart from the little ramshackle shed you do have a side door there through into a garage so a two bedroom with a garage bit of an unusual thing i know i'm just going to come back a little bit more just to give you a bit more space to see a bit more of the room now there's no getting away from it this property is sat on the bath road at pickwick so there is a fair bit of traffic to the front but it is a nice section along here and a real bonus to have all this parking space is out here so lots of turning room in here with the gravel driveway and then you have got the garage here as well now you will notice that there is a pathway obviously a gate on here as well there is a pathway through and next doors do have right of access across this pathway to get out to where their parking is as well but you could easily segregate that off with a gate if you wanted to contain dogs etc and that was the way forward so a really fantastic two bedroom in the heart of Corsham a cottage at that and a lovely view at the moment at the back and a garage this is very unusual so hence the price range please do get in touch and we'll get a viewing arranged for you as soon as possible